Hey, what's up everyone? It's Adam and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a YouTube Shorts video with the captions and everything just like this. First thing you want to do is go to kapwing.com and this is a browser software you can use on your desktop or your mobile phone. They do not have an app yet and they're not sponsoring this, but when I did come across it, I love them for how easy this is to do. So we're going to tap create new project and you can do this all with a free account. Yes, you can upgrade and it's $24 a month or $192 a year. And I think it's worth the money, but let's just start with this free account. First thing you want to do is upload a video. And it sounds funny, but I'm actually going to use the video I created as an example. So you can see I have the screen recording here. And what I like to do is separate the audio. And you'll see why in a moment once I kind of do this is let's just say I'm going to cut it right here. Let's see what part that is. I, I don't know. It's like, where are they? Where are they? Okay, perfect. And the reason why you want to separate the audio is when we add subtitles. So we're going to highlight that, scroll all the way to the left. And then what I want to do is change the aspect ratio to 16 by 9, or should I say 9 by 16. And then click on that video and see what that looks like. I can even adjust it from here or just go to crop. I, I don't know. It's like where are they? Where are they? It's like maybe they are. 9 by 16 and like that. So I know exactly where I'm at. And this was a bad screen recording. I'm not going to lie. So I'm just going to stretch it out a little bit and then go up a little bit here. Let's move them over here. All right, perfect. Now let's see where we want to end it. Pick a little candle in a vast darkness. And we should not let that little candle go out. Okay, boom. Let's say I want to end it right there. Let's scroll this over here. And then now we have a 31 second, just, I mean that quickly, from a screen recording to the audio and everything recorded, so, a 31 second. I don't know, it's like where are they? You can edit it however you want. Like let's say, when the camera cuts out right here, I want to adjust it more closely to where Elon is. I can split it right there, come back to this frame, and we're gonna split it right there, let's say. You have to make sure you select the exact frame, otherwise it cut out the audio, but that's okay. We're, we're gonna select that frame, go back to crop, <laughs> and I can move that specific frame to the left like that, and then when I upload it, I want to finish it off. <laughs> you can see it changes the frame yeah, without messing um, with the audio. So. And that's why I prefer to do it that way, separating the audio. Now let's get into subtitles. The cool thing about it is not only can you adjust all the different font sizes and if you want it bold, italics, um, if you want it to the left or to the right or in the center, up and down, um, you can add a wrap text as well. But let's just do, I'm not going to be exact 100% on this. Let's just say we want to do Bevis uh, new or whatever that is. Um, this is just an example. And we would, let's say we want it to be maybe right there. You can do a full background, a wrap, an outline, or just leave it as none. And even if you do a background color, you can change it to whatever it is you want. So let's say we want the red with the white like that. Um, I, I don't know. It's like, where are they? Where are the aliens? Like, maybe they're. Actually, what I'm going to do. Let's say that's the first part of the video. I, I don't know. It's like, where are they? Where are the aliens? Like, maybe. You can pause it, set the current time, and then add the next one. Maybe there aren't any in this galaxy. Pause it right there. Maybe there aren't any. And this is just an example. I want to do it this way exactly, but you can kind of see what I'm trying to do is layer the subtitles. I, I don't know. It's like, where are, they, where are the aliens? Like, maybe there aren't any in this galaxy. Um, so let's say you do the whole video, or even better yet, they have an auto generation feature if you upgrade. Now, it's one free transcription minute, so I, if I use this right now, it would be just for this. So for the sake of this video, let's go ahead and do that and see how accurate the text is and how well aligned it is. All right, so that took like 45 seconds, and now we're going to see how accurate it did with the timing and the text itself. Where are, they, where are the aliens? Like, maybe there aren't any in this galaxy. Um, and maybe the, what we have here is a very, very rare situation. Wow. Um, you know, a, brief, a, a brief flickering of... See, and even if there is a little bit of a mess up because of uh, stumbling over words and whatnot, you can always just come to that section and fix it. Um, you know, a brief... A, 
a brief flickering of consciousness. And if you want to clean that up a little bit, you can hit shift enter to kind of make it look a little bit more clean in the center or move it to the left or to the right. Now, I will say I like doing this on YouTube if I move it to the left or the right, especially on desktop. But I would suggest to keep it in the center because on TikTok, if you're going to use this for TikTok, which is great for that, um, it cuts off the text, which sucks. I wish I can adjust it left or right a little bit to my liking, like click this and move it. You can't do that. But my suggestion is just keep it in the center. So let's finish and hit done. Now, let's say we like the video and we're like, oh, OK, this is accurate. You know, maybe I need to make a tweak there or you know, maybe I need to adjust this. You could even zoom in and kind of see if it's accurate. Where are, they, where are the aliens? Like maybe there aren't any in this galaxy. And maybe the, what we have here is a very... Like let's say I, I needed the movie here. You can adjust it even by like the millisecond. So let's go ahead and export this. And if you do have a free account, um, you could even add audio. They offer some audio, uh, like these little songs and whatnot. You know, there's a bunch of them in here and they offer that for free with the free account. And of course, there's some limitations. There's other things I'll show in Kapwing. But again, to finish this video out, we're going to hit export video. Now, just so you know, when you do have a free account, you can't make the videos private um, unless you do upgrade. And it is in standard 720p. So just keep that in mind. It's going to be public within Kapwing's app when you look at templates and other creator videos and you search for that. But we're going to title this uh, Elon Musk Inspiration, let's say. And then we're going to play it to make sure everything looks fine. I, I don't know. It's like, where are they? Maybe they aren't. And maybe the... And of course, I would have done better than that like I did in my original video. But the other thing about sharing this is you can embed it. You can copy the link so you can direct people on Kapwing's website for this video. Uh, you can share it to TikTok if you link your TikTok account and it would upload there and then you go to your phone and just approve and upload it straight from the app. It's really cool. I've done it plenty of times, but let's go ahead and download this and finish it out. We're going to select the files and as you can see, it's right here. And then of course, from here, you would just finish out the details and make it to your liking, maybe add a thumbnail, all that stuff that you do in YouTube originally. And because it was a YouTube shorts video, it did upload pretty quickly, and let's see what it looked like on the link in the I final know. video. It's like, where are, they, where are the aliens? Like, maybe there aren't any in this galaxy. As you can see, the ratio is perfect. Everything is lined up right. And, of course, make sure you do add your hashtag shorts link or hashtag. And after that, you're good to go. So hopefully this video helped on how simple it is to do a video like this with the subtitles and making sure it's the right aspect ratio for your YouTube shorts creation. I highly recommend adding subtitles for them. I'm going to do it more and more. People tend to like that for some reason. And I don't know. I think most people watch videos in silence anyway. So thanks for watching this. I truly appreciate it. And I'll see y'all on the next one.